Fall for the Arts is like this event that happens every year around the time of like homecoming and fall, you know, autumn-ish. And um, it's when all of the art classes and subjects or like, like instrumentalists and vocalists and all those kind of people and artists um, like gather around and get to show what they have um, to offer for Darlington. Um, it's a really like big event. Um, like all sections of our school, like the upper school, the lower school, the middle school, we all come. And then people like even alumni come sometimes um, to see like the artwork and to see the performances and stuff. It's a lot of fun. Walking into the Fall for the Arts was kind of hectic, but it's awesome at the same time because there's so many different choices that you can um, choose from. Like you, there's you know you can paint a painting or you can you know paint pottery. You can make crafts in a flower or you can listen to people perf like singing. Um, there is an auction, a silent auction going on. Then there's on the upstairs track you could walk around look at people's paintings. Um, I think it's probably like musical classes in general are my favorites of the day because like I can just go there and like let everything else that has happened in the day like like go. Like I don't have to worry about um, I don't know the stresses of the rest of the day. I performed in a Darlington performance when we sang "Some Nights" by Fun and "Fidelity" by Regina Spector, um, and I also performed in a concert choir um, performance. For concert choir, you have to try out and. Um, you know, you're let in or whatever. But then after you're let in, you have the, op the option to try out for Darlington's, which is a select female acapella group um, within Concert Choir. So if you weren't in Concert Choir, you wouldn't be able to try out for Darlington's. Fall for the Arts was moved this year to the Huffman because of the terrible weather that kind of came in. It was like, uh, it was really weird. It like, it rained and then it stopped and then it rained again. So they had to move it then, or else they wouldn't have been able to set up in time. Um, Positively, it was good because, uh, I don't know, there's, it's probably, it was easier to focus on who was performing and also it was like more organized where you could like see where everything was, whereas like outside at the middle school uh, um, in years past, it was a little more hectic and you didn't really know where to go, you just like, oh my gosh, you're kind of overwhelmed. My name is Marilyn Steele, class of 2013, and this is Darlington Story number 100.